Today we're going to review part number 28580. This is the red line trailer inner wheel bearing. These replacement bearings are high quality tapered roller bearings designed for high speed use. All bearings will have an industry standard number regardless of the brand. On this one, if you look on the inner ring, it would be stamped 28580. And the easiest way to get a replacement for your trailer would be just look on the wheel bearing and get that number and then we can be able to cross-reference and get you the correct size. The other way is the you need to if you can't get the part number off the wheel bearing you can measure the inner diameter that is the most critical measurement on a wheel bearing. So if you and what you would need to do is use a, a digital caliper like this because the dimensions are extended out to thousandths of an inch and a regular ruler or tape measure just won't work. So if we put the dial digital caliper on the inside, get the internal measurement, the inner diameter would be two inches. Now this wheel bearing does consist of three parts. The inner ring or cone is in the middle here and it rolls around the tapered roller bearings right here and the tapered roller bearings are held in a cage or roller retainer. And the wheel bearings will use wheel bearing grease or oil to lubricate them. Now there is one other part that is needed and that is the outer race which this bearing would sit in and these outer edges of the rollers would rotate on. That outer race is sold separately. It would be part number 28521 and the critical measurement on that outer race you would need to have would be the outer diameter, which would be 2.875. That should do it for review on part number 28580.